The research findings we are now reporting could be a game changer in the fight against HIV and AIDS. Our goal is to cure AIDS and the time is now. More than 33 million people worldwide are infected with HIV-1, including more than 1 million people in the United States. And every year, another 50,000 Americans are infected with HIV. Current therapies have transformed AIDS into a chronic illness, but the root of the problem, the virus has not been eliminated, only suppressed. Our goal is based on a simple concept. If you want to cure a viral-based illness, eliminate the virus. My colleagues and I developed molecular tools that permitted us to successfully eradicate HIV-1 from cultured human cells. We have the technology and our findings are proof of concept that we are moving in the right direction. Our approach, which is still years removed from the clinical setting, would not only eliminate the virus permanently, but also create a protection against a new infection or reinfection. The molecular tools developed consist of targeting strand of RNA called guide RNA and the DNA snipping enzyme. When deployed simultaneously, the guide RNA hunts down the viral genome and the snipping enzyme takes over, eradicating completely the HIV-1. The newly virus-free cell then repairs itself. By discovering a way to permanently rid human cells of HIV-1 in a laboratory setting, we have set the stage for additional preclinical work that we believe will lead to a permanent cure for HIV and AIDS. The clinical application of our research may also serve as a therapeutic protection against the HIV-1. We believe this research has set the stage for the development of a potential cure for patients with AIDS, as well as for patients with other viral-based diseases. However, I think this also shows the importance of federal investment into research in academic medical centers, because without that investment, research of this type would be impossible.